I want you to really look at how hard the work is. My guy stand up on a ladder hanging over the balcony just to give us A1 work. These hallways will never look good if we don't skim coat, sand, and paint the whole hallway because it's an old house. So you have to do everything at one shot to make it all come together. This is the end of part of upstairs to bring it all together. When you come out, the stew gonna be looking the same way as the inside of the house. The hallway go all the way down. Let us see what you're doing, Mito. Let us see. We're gonna be on TV now. Let us see, Mito. Let us see, Mito. You're gonna be famous, Mito. 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 See the hole? See, when people do bathrooms, they don't frame out like this. I see anything bad in this house, I cut it out like cancer. You see, you got brand new joist beans up there, sitting the floor upstairs. When you put weight on top of weight, you have to frame it back out the right way so it can hold the weight. That's what we do. We tear it down and put it back. Brand new electricity, brand new plumbing. We're gonna change everything in this bathroom. This bathroom is gonna be a custom-made bathroom when I get finished. Bonds Construction must let the viewers know that we are the number one construction company that's coming up on this side. We're going to give you what you paid for in some extra. So when I find it, I can't go back to the table and tell you that I'm not going to do it because you need two joist beams. I'm going to put the joist beams in because it's going to help my company in the long run. I'm not going to do no work that I can't finish. I finish everything I do. There's no reason that Bonds Construction shouldn't be having big contracts. We already did all the residential. Champagne will show you that we do industrial work too. Got plenty of jobs for the city. So she can let them know that we need this work around here. We don't play. As you see, I already ripped this out because I had to design and put it back. You know, this is how the house is look. The cabin used to be here. Everything's gonna go on these walls now to get them more room in the kitchen when they come in, more cabinet space. You're gonna spend money in Jersey City, of Newark, people buy kitchens and bathrooms. The kitchen and bathroom is number one, the rest of the house must sell. And this is what we do. I got one more floor for you, it's my basement. The basement is gonna be a basement apartment too. Whoever get the first floor, they get the basement. I wanna show you how bad that this mold took over this house. Take a walk with me, Champagne. Get to the bottom steps. 
Take a picture of these steps too, champagne. See all that's back. And come on, nobody off. standing here, walking on it. Man, yeah. Show her the walls. Make sure you show them the walls, champagne. This is how the house looked it when you came in. I had to save some footage so y'all can see this back. Look at the steps. Dry, run it out. When we give it back, everything will be done tip top shape. You won't see no more blister pranks, no more holes, none of that. Look how bad it looks. Very bad. Come on, Champagne, watch this stuff. Mm -hmm. You got it. Right there. Now come on down, boy. Got it. Basement apartment. Turn the lights on. I left this mold up here so y'all can see. You see this? The whole basement was molded out like that. See the other side? All molded. As you see, four feet from the floor. You see, four feet from the floor is all new feet rock. The reason why the mold travels up is don't go from the top, it comes from the bottom. You clean it all up and check it out. For the people that, that left, whoever ran it upstairs, they got two extra rooms. There's one room here. One room in here. See? Very big room. But they have a big problem there. A lot of mold. A lot of mold is basically coming running at all. 